Hi guys, um, Rapid Chess here. So I will not use show Magnus's game today and uh, <laughs> was um, just uh, a bit uh, tired of uh, watching his games, uh, even though he plays really like exciting chess. Not tired, but I um, just want to show you something else, uh, a game which probably doesn't make too much, uh, too much sense to me. Uh, Congratulations to Magnus, he won his 8th title at uh, uh, Weikanze, uh, which is record. Uh, the next is 5 wins, um, uh, like somebody, I don't remember. Kasparov had 3 wins and Karpov 2. Uh, I think uh, uh, Korchnoi might have won uh, like about 4. So excellent. Uh, oh yeah, Anand, I think, on second place. Uh, so uh, so this game uh, between Shankland and uh, Karyakin. Uh, some Shankland, I've heard that he's a big um, uh, theoretician and somehow learns a lot, but doesn't like play really that strong the, the positions just um, just big learner, big student of the game, as um, Ian Gustafsson would say. So he plays d4, I think it's his standard move. His white pieces, and Sergei plays knight f6, e6, knight c3, and bishop to b4. So Sergei tries uh, uh, very limited, uh, he has very limited uh, choice against uh, d4, 1d4. He plays uh, uh, b6 uh, very often, but when uh, white plays knight c3, so it's considered that bishop b4 gives the most of advantage. And later you can play d5 with transposition to Ragozin. f3, this move has been played by Van Forest. Uh, uh, Van Forest played the Samish with a3, but the idea is very common. Um, c5, attacking the center. Uh, and uh, queen can go to f5, which is important. Uh, d5, the most uh, principled uh, reply, I think. Uh, this pawn is, I'm not saying it's awkward, but um, just with d5, white captures this uh, space. And black played a move which um, surprised me, b5. Yeah, it's total ancient move. And that's what I was thinking about this game, yeah, so that what... Unfortunately, this game uh, becomes, I, I think, uh, recently they are, uh, appear more often that players play so much theory, this is ridiculous, yeah. There is no, like, sense in making too many comments, yeah, because players, they just... Um, Probably they, they, they know what they're doing, yeah, but uh, when engine just shows you these moves, yeah, I don't know, <laughs> they they can't explain them, yeah, you have to play like this, yeah. You put uh, e6 pawn, which I myself wouldn't play, and you, uh, and this black plays voluntarily, yeah, and they, they have to play e6, okay, but... Uh, and they put this b5 pawn because ancient says so, yeah, a4. Um, uh, I, 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 I just, uh, I never thought of this move, but if I'm like study, uh, studying for uh, something, yeah, so you have to play like this, otherwise you, you get worse positions. This all are ancient lines. And uh, Sergei also doesn't think and the position again is not that forced, yeah, so um, knight to d7 kind of leaving this pawn attacked. So he takes and plays knight to e5. So this is uh, some gambit, I don't know, like Blumenthal gambit. Um, uh, black gives up a pawn for a tempo, yeah, and they threaten c4 and knight to d3, uh, kind of... Uh, Given check to king, and um, uh, so black will hold initiative. Very uh, reasonable approach to chess. Takes with the queen, 
uh, again bishop f4 the move i would never consider yeah you want to have um, I, I i was i would play something like queen c2 maybe and after c4 I, I would lose probably yeah engine already shows that it's much better so white played bishop d2 and then they they forced to play this yeah and uh, now the the knight is pinned takes uh, so knight cannot give check again the engine move uh, knight to h3 um, okay this i can understand yeah because black will not take this knight for sure and uh, on e2 it doesn't have any good square maybe i uh, you can go to f5 and to g3, but knight to, to h3 for some reason, uh, probably to cover the king from f2. Yeah, so this is the idea. Yeah, knight to f2, queen b7, and this already a mistake, a decisive mistake. So they played uh, uh, Karakin sword for 20 minutes, uh, so he was ready for move um, 15, which is very good and uh, Sam is still playing uh, on seconds, on increment. Uh, so uh, black is pawned down, they have a good bishop, uh, they have the spawn attack, which you can capture because uh, queen, bishop takes f2, we need the queen. And um, uh, white needs to, you know, finish the development and black king is also not castled um, so queen b7 attacking this pawn and uh, white castled and sergey had to play queen b4 but he played queen b7 for a reason yeah it's really hard to deny taking a pawn when you're trying to do it so he took and he took um, took here, attacking the bishop, and uh, now black skin suddenly is in trouble. And uh, also notice that uh, black still is pawned down, so their position is actually terrible. So he calculated this line that after takes, you cannot take with rook because queen takes a1. So <laughs> after that, uh, naturally he played king h1 yeah and um, black is uh, piece up I'm just saying that I'm not that surprised because Shanklin had uh, had this all prepared yeah he understood what he was doing and Sergei got uh, just um, you know um, got into opening trap yeah it's uh, a little grandmaster opening trap on move uh, 20 yeah, so he had to grab this piece, but um, his position is uh, just losing, yeah. Queen b3, um, engine suggests that queen b4 was a bit better, but um, when you have a dark square bishop, uh, you want to, you know, control the light squares, yeah. Play it here, and just queen to c7 without check, and you cannot play castles because of this and your rook is trapped, uh, so you lose this rook. Um, so he didn't play like this. Sergei actually had uh, one hour, but um, uh, the pos probably he's, he saw that he's losing anyway. Uh, he could have thought a little bit earlier, think about, uh, yeah, in this position he had hour 20 but he already was tr probably he was thinking that he was committed and he, so he played all these forced variations without too much thinking so okay let's finish the game uh, again uh, pro uh, trying to exchange the queens but check and knight to d5 um, in this position, the best move was uh, to play here and play. Um, yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, the queen takes, of course. Uh, uh, rook takes, takes the queen, and um, 
So this position is winning for white because they have uh, actually a material advantage, but uh, it's kind of Sergei's position to defend. Uh, probably he didn't see it, he miscalculated, and uh, and this position uh, queen d5 check yeah I think in this position he resigned uh, because uh, of this this move uh, and uh, winning the rook all right uh, thank you very much for watching and see you next time